In mathematics, the Brouwer Siegel theorem, named after Richard Brouwer and Carl Ludwig Siegel, is an asymptotic result on the behavior of algebraic number fields, obtained by Richard Brouwer and Carl Ludwig Siegel. It attempts to generalize the results known on the class numbers of imaginary quadratic fields, to a more general sequence of number fields k 1 k 2 display style k underscore 1 k underscore 2 l dots in all cases other than the rational field q and imaginary quadratic fields the regulator re of key must be taken into account because key then has units of infinite order by dirichlet's unit theorem the quantitative hypothesis of the standard brouwer siegel theorem is that if di is the discriminant of key then k i q log d I zero as I infinity display style frac k underscore i math bf q log d underscore i to zero text as i to inf t. Assuming that and the algebraic hypothesis that key is a Galois extension of q, the conclusion is that log h i r i log d i 1 as i infinity display style frac log h underscore i r underscore i log sqrt d underscore i to 1 text as i 2 inf t where hi is the class number of key if one assumes that all the degrees k i q Display style k underscore i math bf q are bounded above by a uniform constant n. Then one may drop the assumption of normality. This is what is actually proved in Brouwer's paper. This result is ineffective, as indeed was the result on quadratic fields on which it built. Effective results in the same direction were initiated in work of Harold Stark from the early 1970s. <laughs> 